Thank okay, you. so this is a story that's obviously close to home for us here at 2GB because, as I said at the time when these allegations were first printed in the Sydney Morning Herald, they involve people who used to work at this radio station, one of them being Alan Jones, another one being one of the alleged victims. And I'll read to you what we read at the time when Kate McClymont broke the original story. Uh, this came from Alan Jones's lawyer. Our client denies ever having indecently assaulted the persons referred to in your letter and your suggestion that he has is scandalous, grossly offensive and seriously defamatory of him. And I'll share a summary of what Kate McClymont reported back then in the Sydney Morning Herald. A major investigation can reveal allegations that Alan Jones used his position of power to prey on a number of young men, indecently assaulting them, groping or inappropriately touching them without their consent. When he was in his early 20s, the 2GB employee had the job of driving Alan from 2GB to his home in Circular Quay. He says, during those 10 minutes, it would be wandering hands. I would be driving and he would be putting his hand on my leg and then you'd sort of push his hand away. He also spoke about incidents that allegedly occurred in elevators. There are other allegations that appeared at the time in the Herald, but considering the latest development, the arrest of Alan Jones, I think we'll leave those allegations for now and we'll also defer to New South Wales Police. So this is the story that's just appeared on the Sydney Morning Herald website. Alan Jones arrested over allegations he indecently